Hey, what's going on, people? Welcome back to my channel. It's Pop Mix coming at you with another unboxing video. And in today's video, we're doing mystery boxes. We're going to take a look at the proper poppers mystery box and some stuff from the nerdy newt. I'm excited to see what we got. Let's see what we pull. Hey guys, so like I said, we're gonna crack open some mystery boxes. I am very excited for this. We gonna we have a cool one here from the Proper Popper. They have a YouTube channel. Make sure I'm gonna make sure to link everything down below. But they have a YouTube channel, Instagram. Awesome collector, really good friend. I've really come close with him. He's an awesome guy. These boxes were super cool. They did boxes in honor of their baby that was coming soon with, within him and Sim1, aka Simone. So they actually have a YouTube channel. So they have, make sure to check them out. They do some awesome videos on there. They do a lot of cool different things and unboxings and sodas and stuff. But they did these mystery boxes. So we'll go over the details in a little bit. But that's the first one. And the second one here is the Nerdy New Collectibles. This is the first time I'm actually ever getting boxes from them. I've seen a lot of people open up their boxes. I've heard about them a lot. I just never got my hands on them. So this is the first one. So I figured we'll do these together and we'll just crack open and see if we can pull some top hits. But before we do that, you guys already know, make sure down below that you click on that thumbs up button and you like this video. Feel free to comment as well. Let me know which one of these are going to be your favorite pulls. Any of the pops that I pull out. Also, make sure that you are following me on Instagram. That's at pop underscore migs when you do get a chance. And if you aren't already, subscribe to my channel. You can click down below on that red button. It's nice and easy for you guys, but you'll stay up to date with all my content. I appreciate you so, so much. Everyone that already is subscribed, thank you. Thank you very much. Honestly, it's crazy how many people have been showing me support in this community. And I really appreciate all of you guys, even everyone over on Instagram as well. But let's crack into these boxes quick. So I'm going to do these la uh, last. So I'll do these afterwards. But we're going to crack open into the nerdy new boxes quick. Let's get these open. And I'll go over some of the details on these boxes. I believe there should be four, four mystery boxes in here. But we'll go over some of the details. So these were actually part of the weekend box. I think there was something like that called. And this is basically what it was. So $15 for each one. Each one came with one pop. It's kind of like a hit or miss type of thing because the pops can range anywhere from $5 up to over $100. You had commons, chases, exclusive, vaulted, that kind of thing. The top pits were the Blacklight Hulk, which I would love because that's one of the black lights I'm missing. Ric Flair with the belt, a Robot Freddy, super cool. So you can do up to four boxes, uh, orders at once. So I did do four. So like I said, 15 each. And we're just hoping that we get, so it looks like they're just kind of loose in here, but uh, they're individually bubble wrapped, but they are upside down. So let's see if anything here has protectors of any sort. So this one does not. This one does not. All right, so it seems like none of them have protectors. So we're just gonna kind of pull out here wrap and we'll take a look here's the first pop that we pull three two one bow <laughs> so we got oh man no bueno on this not a big fan so this is the marvel studios first 10 years uh box box lunch exclusive this is star lord and this is one of the gold uh, metallics that they came out with they came out with so many of these. Uh, if you can see on the back, like the whole set was insane. Uh, I don't think this, uh, this has like a little bit of a crease. I don't know if the boxes were, you know, I think it said that some will have some damage or whatever, but that's, that's fine. But yeah, not really like a huge fan. I mean, it's a cool one, Star-Lord. And it's cool that it's gold, honestly. Like some of the golds are pretty cool. I just, there's just so many of them. And most of the time they don't really have too much value. So let's take a look at pop number two. You know, I do a mystery boxes, obviously. Want to get you know stuff that I like that fits into my collection and I don't already have, and then also you know stuff with good value would be nice. So here we go, three, two, one, pop number two. Oh, oh, this is a cool one. I, actually, this definitely would fit in. So this is Jora Mormont. This is from Game of Thrones. Mormont. This is Jora. This is the guy who was obsessed with Khaleesi. <laughs> So this is a cool one. Game of Thrones pops are, are tricky because they were very valuable. They were really popular. And then they just kind of plummeted. I have a good amount of them. I'm a huge you know, Game of Thrones fan. But then I kind of stopped collecting them because there were just so many of them. And they didn't have too much value and stuff. And I got like the core ones that I really liked up here. And they're actually all out of box. So 
I don't really have any. I have actually I have a few that are inbox, a couple exclusives and stuff. So that's a pretty cool one. All right, here's pop number three. All right, number three. Three, two, one. Oh, a wrestling pop. Becky Lynch, this is an Amazon exclusive. Cool. So Amazon exclusive, she has a shirt on, the man. I don't know much about her. Um, not really a big current wrestling fan. I, you know, the, the old school legends, Bret Hart, Undertaker there, of course, Stone Cold, all them. Like I remember them when I was younger, but as far as like some of these newer ones, I don't really know too much about them. Some wrestling pops have some good value. A lot of people collect them. I know they're pretty popular. So, all right, here's the last one. Hoping for something good, but then we'll check values right after this one. All right, here we go. Pop number four, last one. Three, two, one. Oh, Deadpool. So this is Wizard Deadpool. I I don't have this one. There's so many Deadpools. I do have a good amount of them, but this is a Barnes and Noble exclusive. I've seen this around a lot. Don't really think it has too much value, but that one and so I guess I opened it on the opposite side, which is good because I didn't get to see the top of the pops. But then we got here just their information. So make sure to check them out for sure. Nerdy Newt collectibles. So it's at the Nerdy Newt on Instagram and they're and the nerdy new as well on Facebook nerdy new.com uh, again I have all their information down below, but let's take a look at some values real quick and just see if we Hopefully got something back one for sure fits into the collection and will stay in the collection the other ones I don't know yet. I have to see but let's take a look at some of the values So we'll start off with the Star Lord. So this was the box lunch exclusive and of course I have to type it in because it has that extra sticker on it all right, so Star Lord Chrome Gold is eighteen dollars, so not too bad. So eighteen bucks. So he is a little over what we paid. Again, these were fifteen dollars each. It wasn't guaranteed value, so chances of getting bad. Ooh, all right, Jora was a good one. Jora, we got twenty-one dollars PPG. So not too bad so far, value-wise for sure. We're doing pretty good here. And we got Becky Lynch. Whoa, Becky Lynch. Oh, this is a hit. I <laughs> I knew these wrestling ones have some good value, but like I said, I don't know much about them. So for a $15 box, this is definitely a good one. So this Becky Lynch, this is, of course, an Amazon exclusive. It's got the WWE sticker license on it, which is super cool. This one is $46 PPG. Oh, man. How about that? So that's like a... That's a top hit. That's sick. And then we got the Barnes and Noble exclusive Deadpool. There's a ton of these, so I have a feeling. So yeah, this is fifteen dollars PPG. Pretty standard. I didn't think that one would be much higher, but this hit. Oh wow! So this box actually was not that bad. So let's take a look at what we got. So we got eighteen, twenty-one. 46 and 15 so we actually did pretty well so $15 each so that is $60 for all four plus shipping let's say 70 75 dollars and we got a hundred dollars back total on this box so we got our value back for sure we got a pretty sweet pop that's almost $50 which is insane I definitely would not have guessed that this one's got good value and it is an awesome pop it's an old pop this is from 2016 so we had some pretty good stuff there. All right, let's check out the proper popper. Let's see what he got in store for us. So I'll go over this quickly, the details. So like I said, they did this box specifically because they wanted to raise some money. Uh, they were having a baby or a baby's on the way, which is super exciting for them. Congratulations on that. I know I've been in contact with him. Like I said, we talk almost every day. It's been a really good friend in the community that I've been able to, you know, connect with. But these were $30, so they were $30 shipped each. You only get one pop and it was only 50 boxes total. So since you were able to choose a number, so we have 25 and 28 here on the two boxes that we got in. So like I said, this was out of 50 boxes total, $30 shipped. 
for each one, but you were guaranteed at least $15, so you're gonna get something. More than likely, you'll probably get a common pop, but that's still pretty cool. Anyone that gets from $15 to $19, one of those pops, automatically gets entered into a live YouTube wheel that they're gonna do to give away a 10-inch Target Con Stormtrooper. So that's a cool way of getting a, another entry into another uh, possible winning. The top hit, of course, was the Ken Griffey Jr. $200 pop, which would be so cool if I could pull that. That'd be awesome. In its place, there's gonna be a Babe Ruth pop, which is really not worth too much, but that's the one that they're gonna send down. Then obviously you'll get in contact with him to get the bigger one. Um, some of the other top hits, just real quick, was a Power and Up Vegeta, $80. There's a King Bradley Chase, which is $75. Hero Killer Stain shared which is seventy dollars so a couple like you know anime pops it was a mix this is actually their first ever mystery box that they have done uh but more than anything uh regardless of what the pops are i mean it'd be cool to get one of the top ones but it was more about you know supporting a good friend and an awesome you know person in the community uh especially with you know their baby coming and you know i have a baby so i know you know how it is and how expensive it can get so it was cool to be able to support them but let's crack into these boxes so cool thing here is the 25 the box of 25 has like question marks on it all over it so i don't know what that means 28 doesn't so i'm gonna do the 25 second maybe that means it's the big one who knows all right let's crack into this one first and we'll just see what we got and we'll take a look at values of course just to kind of see what the, the pop is worth see if we got some of our money back and it would at least be 15 dollars worth but we'll see so they do have a uh, couple, you know, little promotions here. SPD soda kit. So this is someone that does some of the, like the soda, soda kits. I know they they have a cover for the pogs and stuff. They have they give a little code here, which is pretty cool. So I can get a discount. All right. So not only is it a nice box, it's also in a sorter. That's why you like buying stuff of, off of other collectors and content creators because they know you know how to how to do it right. All right, here we go. First pop in this it has a number two on it. Don't know what that is, but. We're gonna see three two one and it's in a paper oh let's go gambit all right so this is a black light gambit and he did put the price on there so 25 dollars is where he was at when this shipped uh, i'll double check because maybe it went up because these black light pops have been amazing We've also got a nice note here thank you you went right over the pitcher's head but the shortstop was not too far behind him good news is you made it to second base and you are safe even though you did not land a top hit uh it means the world to us please tag us of course i'm going to be tagging them let them know i'll hit them up anyways and better living situation for their baby you contributed to the mystery box means you are now part of our family and you are truly grateful to add you to the pop crew army keep it popping thank you so much the proper popper and honestly this is a sick pop so i already have this one i do but it's a little damn dinged up but it's not bad but the one i have actually has the uh that little special edition sticker so i actually like the target one sticker better so that's actually a cool one because i'll probably be able to just swap it out but let's just check it quickly the value just to see if it did fluctuate at all because sometimes this stuff moves and you never know uh yeah 22 bucks so if it, it moves it moves around a little bit but pretty close to what it was when it shipped out these were shipped out a little while ago so all right last one here this one like i said this is number 25 and this one has question marks all over it when the one for 28 didn't so don't know what that means unless maybe they forgot to put the question marks on all the boxes all right so on this one this one didn't say anything but on this one it says open uh first before the pop on this one and we also got the little card again all right so this says Congratulations! Are you confused yet? You just swung a perfect game, and for that you are just too sweet. By picking the number 28 box, you have won a free number 25 mystery box. Both numbers were always set to be connected. Best of luck in finding our top hit if the... Wait. Best of luck in finding our top hit if the run a Ken Griffey Jr. pop. Keep it popping. I don't know if they miswrote something, but is this the hit? Uh, so, 20. All right, so 28 is the box I chose, and I guess automatically, if you got 28, they automatically gave you 25, which is why I got two of them. 
but let's see because if this is um, the Babe Ruth, that would be the, the Griffey, but I guess we'll see. Ah, it's not. Oh, man. So I was confused what that means. So we got Heifer, Rocco's Modern Life, $22. Oh, man. I was psyched. I was confused. So it does say, are you confused yet? You just swung a perfect game. And for that, you're just too sweet. By picking the box 28, which is the one I actually chose, you have won a free number 25 box. Both numbers were always said to be connected to each other. Best of luck in finding our top hit, Ken Griffey. So I guess I didn't because it's the heifer, but this is sick. This is a glow. I'm going to take this off so you can see it. This is from Rocco's Modern Life. It's a glow in the dark uh, chase. And this says $22. So we'll just triple check. Yeah, 22 bucks still. So it still has the same value. So. Two awesome pops. Thank you, guys. I definitely am confused. <laughs> it says it like, are you confused? So I happened to open up the other one first before this one, which had the note, and it was like a little confusing. And I'm like, why did I get two of these? But I guess because I got one, it automatically gave me the other one. But we did get uh, the Blacklight Gambit and this cool heifer. So I don't have any of these. So these are, well, I do have this one, but it's cool that it's the Target actual sticker. This one I don't have, but this is an awesome pop for sure. Thank you guys so much. Either way, so like I said, this is going to be a fun thing. I'm just happy that you know I was able to help support them in any way. They put up awesome boxes. Thank you so much. Please make sure you like down below on this video. Also comment which one of these was your favorite pop. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If you aren't already, you can click on that red button and follow me over on Instagram at pop underscore makes. Thank you for awesome mystery boxes to the proper proper and sim one for that awesome, you know, two pops in one, which is great. Like I always say, guys, make sure you're staying safe out there. Until I'm back with another video, take it easy, guys.